<coughs> Point of order, Your Honor. I beg the court's indulgence to plead for my, uh, not guiltiness. It was a simple misunderstanding, really. <coughs> Spitting on the sidewalk is illegal in this town. Judge Logan has us enforce the law with no exceptions. It's just God! In conclusion, I throw myself on the mercy of the court. Oh, please, Your Honor. Pretty, 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 please, with the uh, 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 chocolate sauce on it. Guilty. <laughs> well, he did actually do it. So let's just pay the fine and get out of here. Fifty years, hard labor. <laughs> Fifty years? <laughs> oh, it's all my fault. I had to do something to stop him from stealing my gum. I thought it would teach him a lesson. Your Honor, you can't be serious. Fifty years for spitting on the sidewalk? Look, I'm Eli Shane, and I want to see justice done, too. But this is... A Shane, huh? Never much cared for the Shanes. But in your case, I'll make an exception. And not put you away for aggravated sass! Lock him up! Wait! This is a travesty of justice! I've got my eye on you. Trixie, Cord, we need to poke around this jail and see what it's made of. Why? Because we're gonna bust Pronto out. <laughs> Mind? Uh, why, yes, uh, yes, indeed. I am the head of a vast organization, infamous for its villainy and sharp attire. I thought you were pinched for spitting gum. Uh, true, but that was the least of my crimes. Uh, what are you in for? Public speaking. He's in for breathing too loud, and they locked him up for aggravated smiling. Yeah. That Judge Logan has a real racket going. He, he, he locks you up for breaking ridiculous laws and then sells you off for hard labor. And not just any hard labor. I hear they send you to work for Dr. Black. <gasps> Dr. Black? That's what my source tells me. <laughs> Judge Logan clears out his jails and Black gets free workers for his smelters. Well, how long do we have? Few days, maybe. Then we need to move fast. Now let's go over the plan. This delivers supplies to the jail every day. Paid the driver to take his place. If we pull this off, we'll cut away everyone undetected. Good. Remember, guys, Pronto isn't the only one in there who's been unjustly locked up. There are other prisoners in there that need our help. Then we can put a stop to that judge. Now, tell me about the shot I've got to make. It's pretty close to impossible, so I get you this. Pretty awesome. Yeah, that SVX 5000 scope gives you every angle, every reading, every trajectory to make amazing shots. And I mail ordered this speed stinger slug to go with the scope. He's the only slug that can make it work, because all the scope's data and angles are put right into his little high-tech goggles. Hi, stunts. Welcome to the team. Now, let's go over the plan. First, Cord will drive up to the jail and act casual, like he's delivering supplies. Trixie will make sure the guard is distracted and give me the sign. Then it's all up to me and the speed stinger. And if everything goes according to plan, we hit velocity, ricochet off the wagon, rebound off the flagpole, make its way to the cooling tower, make a series of bank shots to the jail roof. Go in through the air vent, make a bank shot, a quick roll, spring the lock into the cage. Ah! 
Let's open the cuffs, and with the coast clear, get everyone to safety without anyone being the wiser. Okay, guys, let's go spring pronto. Just trust the high-tech stuff, right? This is a little confusing. I hope you're getting all their stunts. Oh no. Oh man. Oh. Not good. That was a complete and total disaster. What did we tell you, Eli? The one weak spot in your plan is that nobody can make that shot. Yeah, nobody. Well, except maybe Mario Bravado. Mario who? What? Oh, come on. Mario Bravado? Only the greatest trick shot slinger ever. Here, check it out. his own show and everything. What happened to him? Apparently he dropped out of the spotlight and now owns a restaurant out in the middle of nowhere. Well, I think it's time Mario Bravado made a comeback. And fast. This can't be the right place. Why would a trickshot legend live here? Welcome to Ricochet Pizza. We sling the best pies in Slug Terra. What can I get you? Are you Mario Bravado? No, I'm Mario the pizza guy. Look, I think I know who you are, and I've been told that only Mario Bravado can make the trick shot I need. Sorry, that Mario's retired. The only things I sling now are pizza pies. So if you want to keep talking, order something. See, a friend of mine has... Uh, uh, uh. No pizza? No talking. Oh, okay. I'll have the Super Slinger Super Cheese. <laughs> Order up! One Super Super Cheese! All right, let me tell you about the shot I need from you. See, a friend of mine... I already told you, I'm retired. I'll never, ever, ever fire a slug again. This is a matter of life and death. Judge Logan has been selling prisoners to Dr. Black and... <laughs> What you really need help with is your hearing. I said no! <laughs> that went well. So I'm surrounded by fire scorpions, but they realize I am the toughest Molinoid they've ever seen. <laughs> then what happened? <laughs> One simple nod, and the entire pack scurries away in fear. That's why my organization will bust me out of here. You see, it's about fear and the respect. Kind of a fearful respect. The Molinoid is trouble. Especially with a shame in his corner. Sooner we have them out of here, the better. See what you can do. <sighs> Listen, I... I said no! Now scram! I'm just here to, uh, eat. Uh, uh, can't believe I ate that much pizza. Look, my friend is in real trouble. This isn't for me, it's for him. They tell me you're the only one who can make the shot I need. That's all? Sounds like more trouble than it's worth, kid. Forget it. I'm done slinging. Forever. What happened to you? Excuse me? You were some big hero, then you just disappeared. Uh, I'm no hero. I was a kid with a TV show, that's all. I know a little bit about being famous, you know. My dad was Will Shane. What? Really? Well, you could have mentioned that. Would it have changed your mind? Nope. All right, then. Sorry I wasted your time and mine. Wait, I'm not gonna take the shot. But if it's that important, 
I'll teach you how to do it. Should be no problem for a Shane. I hope you're a good teacher, because I don't have a lot of time. Okay, that's three large, no onion. Thanks for calling ricochets. Okay, remember, 90% of trick shooting is half mental. So first things first, we make the pizza. Uh, what? Uh, if it helps my friend, I'll try anything. Uh, what do you think you're doing? Uh, making pizza? Relax, we'll get to that. First things first, figure out the order, the layers. Plan it out in your head. Can you guess what I'm looking at right now? The ingredients. Uh, wrong. I'm looking at the finished pizza in my head. When you start something, always know what it is you're wanting to finish. In this case, we're making what? Three large pizzas. The works. It's about lining up all the ingredients together. You want to see why this place is called Ricochet Pizza? That's great, but they said no onion. Good, you're paying attention. Now make three large pizzas, the works, no onion. We need to make the whole pizza in one shot. Ricochet pizza, remember? Right. Okay, let's do that again. High-tech stuff just doesn't get it done like finely honed instincts. You got them. You just have to trust them. Okay, so now do we do some slinging? If you mean slinging more pizzas, yes. Okay, hit this with pepperoni without looking. How was that? Uh... I think you need a little more honing. You're improving, Eli, but you gotta relax. Okay, when do I learn to shoot? That's what you've been doing. You just don't know it yet. You've got a trick shooter's heart, Eli, and I've never seen anyone so connected with their slugs, other than me. So why did you quit? I haven't told anyone this, you know. I was at the top of my game. Felt like nothing could go wrong. I guess I was a little too cocky. One day I was offered a job, and I refused. Probably said a few things I shouldn't have. I got called out. If I lost, I'd have to quit forever. I thought I couldn't be beat. I was wrong. I got hit by a slug I had never seen before. Never want to see it again. It was a ghoul, wasn't it? You dueled black. Doesn't matter. I'm a man of my word, and I told you I'd train you. So, have you and Stunts figured it out? And even though you forgot to add extra cheese, I think you're ready. You know Dr. Black is a cheat. He'd never hold up his end of the bargain. You don't owe him anything. This world needs you. So do I. Okay, we're in. Really? Great. But you're making the shot. Good news! I got trained up, and I brought Mario Bravado to back me up. Hey, yeah, hey, look at you. Wow, you're really Mario Bravado. Do you remember the episode of your show, number 56, where you shot that slug right... Lord, we don't have time for this. Nice to meet you, Mario. 
Love the jacket. We got some bad news, Eli. They're leaving. Now. <sighs> I didn't plan for this. I planned for a trick shot to break him out of jail. You can do it, kid. Put all your ingredients together. It's just as easy as making a pizza. What have they been doing? Guys, we need to get a move on. It's been a while, hasn't it, friend? You're gonna sling? You're not afraid of black? I don't have to be either. It's time to come out of retirement. But you're still making the shot. Right. Cord? Catch that train! The Shane Gang? Step on it! There they are! Ha -ha! They've come for me! Hey, who's that other guy? Hey, this Bob Pronto's the real deal! He's got Mario Bravado in his gang! Well, of course! I taught Mario Bravado everything he knows! Mario, who? Hey, Eli! We got trouble up ahead! Once the Express goes in that tunnel, we won't be able to follow. It'll be too late! <laughs> Talk about a trick shot! Take out the guards, free Pronto, and try to stay on this wagon! Gord, you focus on driving! Trixie, we'll need you as a spotter! <laughs> what? <laughs> Two guards, on top of the train! Did you see that, Sean? Don't get cocky, kid! That tunnel's getting closer fast! Yeah, I think they just picked up speed. I got four more guards and we still have to get the prisoners loose. Here we go, kid. Sling it like you mean it. Now that 
slinging some pizza. You said it, kid. Hmm. All this talk of pizza has given Proto a powerful hunger for the extra cheese. Ah, oh, it was hard on the inside, let me tell you. And the food was atrocious. Pronto, you were barely in jail two days. And yet, I survived. You can still make the best trick shots. If you're ever ready to make a comeback for real, you've got a spot on our team. Thanks. But I think I'll stick to slinging pizzas for now. But someday, hey, who knows? Uh, it's great we got Pronto out, but what are we gonna do about Judge Logan? Give him a taste of his own medicine. illegal in these parts. Oh, no, wait. I was sprayed. That gum was awful, like hot sauce and rotten fish. We enforce the law with no exceptions. Your orders, sir. What? Wait! Hold on! This is 